Hello guys, T Gamer here, and it's T Day. Now we're gonna be playing, obviously, a different game for T Day. Uh, we're gonna be playing Crusader Kings. The last game uh, where we were playing Romania on Making History Two for T Day. I'm still debating if I'm going to discontinue it completely, only because. Um, the last tea day that I did right after recording I decided to continue playing just to um, just to play you know speed the series up offline and literally five turns later Germany declared war on us and so I decided you know, with us being weaker, we're not gonna, we're not gonna do that. We're just not gonna play it. Um, really, my only options is probably to uh, become allies with Germany uh, through peace treaty. You know, that way they can gain an ally in Europe, but then that would put me at war with Russia. And yeah, eventually, if Russia ends up in World War Two. So this time we're just going to be playing uh, Crusader Kings. And I've thought about different options. Like I actually thought about making Romania a country, I mean a, a kingdom. Um, essentially I want us to start off as a count and then basically evolve to uh, an emperor. So. Yeah, this series actually may go on for a really long time. Or I might start off as a duke. And I'm kind of still a little deciding on who to be. Um, as you can tell, I don't have uh, the DLCs that would allow me to, the, the champagne Charlemagne, <laughs> Champagne, the Charlemagne DLC, and I don't have any of the religious based ones, so we can't play any of the Muslim nations. We basically can only play as Catholic and Christian based, basically only Christian nations, Catholics and Orthodox. Um, that also means Christian. Uh, heretic religions as well. Um, I was thinking we can either be in the Holy Roman Empire, which I actually have done multiple times so far. Uh, I actually played as oops, this guy who is the only playable lowborn which is funny because as soon as I would click play, his name would be. Oh, that's weird. It's calling him an unplayed. Yeah. Anyways, his name, since he's lowborn, I can't play him. I can't use the ruler designer, but I still can play him, which is weird. Um, as soon as I click play, his last name becomes Von Pomeran, and I usually use the ruler designer once I'm playing to change his last name to Von Matoa, which is the county he is. And, you know, his family start he's literally the founder of his dynasty, so he's the first ever in his dynasty. So I just thought, why not change the name? This way we know where the dynasty came from, which is Matoa. That's where our dynasty began. Um, I don't want to start off as a king to be honest. I simply just want to start off as either a count or a duke. Now I was thinking, for example, if I wanted to be Brandenburg, I'm thinking about actually forming Prussia. You know, I would have to declare war with Pruthina or Pruthenia. And then once I do that, it would become the duchy of 
Prussia. It's actually kind of weird how this game works. Basically, certain titles are... Ah, whoa, what happened to my mouse? Oh, there we go. Certain titles are in their cult with the titles called in their culture so right now it's the duchy well the high chief the chiefdom of Pruthenia but once it's under a catholic nation's control it becomes the duchy of Prussia um, that actually is what I did on my Polish campaign anyways I could make it where we become Prussia Yeah. And then I thought about remaking the the Roman Empire. I just don't like how the Byzantine Empire starts off at war with the Sujiks. Um, I mean, I'm okay with being a small country. Like Denmark. Maybe we'll be Denmark. I've been having a terrible, uh, having terrible mouse problems. Apparently, my wire, because I have a a wire mouse. I kind of want a wireless mouse, but at the same time, I don't. But anyways, let's get this series going. We are going to possibly be. Hmm, Reform Spain. Nah. You know what? Also, if I decide to be a part of the Holy Roman Empire, I'm going to try my hardest. You know what? We're going to be the House of Von Bourbonger. No, wait. Let's be... If I can refine them. Oh, that's right. They're counts. In the beginning. There you go. We're going to be the Habsburgs. And we're going to try to get... Austria. Yep, I already know. Oh, damn it. Already married. Habsburg and Ida. What? So, there's only. Wow, our dynasty's relatively new. Become King of Burgundy. That would be nice. If I could establish that, I kind of would like um, the Jural Kingdoms. I would have to have all of this, or at least more than 51% of it. Uh, to become king of Burgundy and if I did that I would make the duchy of Providence I'd probably take it from this dude and give it to whoever's the mayor of Marcial in the future but we're gonna try our artists to form Austria although the Habsburgs was really really huge um, 
I think at their biggest, their dynasty uh, was connected to the King of Spain in the 1600s. And um, the Kingdom of Naples and Sicilies. And their their Spanish uh, their Spanish branch also was uh, controlling Flanders also at that time. And actually, the highest they've ever truly been was rulers of the Holy Roman Empire. So we're gonna try. Let's see. Okay, she's eight. How old is my son? Okay, six. I wonder if we can kill him. <laughs> that would have been funny. Oops. That sucks. He wants a matrilineal marriage. Don't know why, but oh well. Okay, so we're gonna look for things that are easy to grab, like maybe Lexingburg. It's a literally it's a one territory duchy. And all he has is Matilda. But he does have a sibling. Uh, if only my sister was unmarried. And I'm not gonna kill her husband just just because. I guess we're gonna have to think small. We're gonna change your haircut, dude. I really don't like the hairstyles of medieval times for guys. Mm. Oh, nice. It appears that we have no league but the Holy Roman Emperor himself. So we're not under anyone's command. We're going to try to get Upper Burgundy. That's our main focus for right now. Just because of who my daughter is, we're going to try to go for matrilineal. Nothing. Okay, never mind. We're gonna try to find someone for our son. Mostly to gain. Oh, she's too much older. An alliance. Ooh. House Witten. Fun fact about this house, it's actually um, the main house, or I should say the senior house, of the current royalty of, of Great Britain. And also Belgium, I think. Not 100% for sure. Uh, both Belgium and... Some of the royals, especially the ones close, closer to the throne, 
are, uh, I keep forgetting what it's called, but they're part of a cadet branch of House Witten. Witten. But anyways, I think we're gonna go with that. Uh, marry into House Witten. It'll give us a non-aggression pact with Count Dito. Let's. Where is that? Ah, no stop. Crap. Oh well, we just know it's somewhere in this general area. And if we ever get the power, I would like to help take over these territories. Oh my god, my mouse. Alright. Okay, I get it. Oh, okay. Now that that's somewhat over. Oh, Count Wadrick. I mostly just want something that can give me a good alliance. An ally that's not too far, not too... Ooh, the Duke of Savoy. He's nearby. This is who I'm now married to. We'll just we'll put it on two for now. There we go. Mm -mm -mm. Yeah, that's a that's a pretty good amount. Let's see. Let's actually look at it. Okay. Alright, he has way more military than I do. No. I need you. Actually, no, we're gonna go to three. Oh, 
Wow, that was quick. So now, oops. Now I have a claim on the county of... Which actually I should have checked. Okay, yeah, he's a... He's a semi-independent county. It's not under the control of a duke. This count's also free. So we're gonna... Ah. It's too early for me to put him on a new mission. Still some technology. Actually, I should resend him. To this territory. Oh, but it's part of Lombardy. What are the claimants? I might have to go after. Whoever Oh I hope Alberto de SD isn't this specific guy. It's probably one of his children. Nope. This territory. Well, I'm gonna need that territory. Oh, he's stupid. Oh, maybe he's not. How many people joined? I should have started off his account. Um, anyways, we're going to continue this series next to you. Whoa, wait, what? Ah, oh, my sister. Oh, wait, no, she's not my sister. Why is she trying to kill my son? Anyways, uh, wow, November's 22nd.
can you can see how far I've been playing this. But I hope I didn't spell it wrong. I feel like I spelled it wrong. I still spelled it wrong. Okay, we're just gonna we're just gonna say on Habsburg House. Um, actually, before we actually say, let's. Oh, see, I knew I was spelling it wrong. I felt like Habsburg was just weird. Don't know why. I almost said what it would be in English, which is House of Habsburg. Because if I'm not mistaken, that uh, the word von in German is the equivalent of of. <laughs> but There we go, and I'll see you guys next TA. Don't don't mind this.